Hey guys, I was going to do a quick video. Um, they they did a little bit of the change up on YouTube accounts. So here if I go to my videos, it used to give me a bunch of all my videos that was listed. And I could change it from uh, private to uh, public. And a lot of times I'll do that if I'm working on a couple of video series or whatever. I'll, I'll download them, put them all to private, and then once I have everything done, then I take it off of private and put it to public. So I couldn't find them for nothing. Um, if I click here, it says all videos. It doesn't really do much. Um, and I couldn't for the life of me figure out how to do that. Um, if I came over here to sort... All it does is by most popular, the oldest, and then the newest. Um, there's, I think there should be one that says private there, but whatever. So, what you need to do is you go back to your home, and then Creator Studios. And then it brings it back to the way it used to be. Um, here you can see I've got two videos I'm about to upload um, on these. My the third one, the final one, um, I'm waiting on a part. It should be here uh, Friday. Uh, today's Monday, so I was going to go ahead and set these up to like this is a part one A and a part one B. I wanted to set these public at the same time and then um, whenever part two comes around I can just set that to public. Alright so this is kind of what I was looking for. Um, like I said before in that other one you couldn't even see these videos weren't even popping up. So we'll go ahead and switch this over to public. I'll do the same thing with this one. Oh, so you'll we'll set that over to public. Then we will publish. So that one should be up and going. And I know a lot of my videos are long. But here's here's kind of the way I see things. I could fast forward and just get back down to the brass taxes or whatever. And show you what I did to fix. Or I can go step by step on what I did. So that way if, if I skip something that I didn't think was important, maybe I've done it a million times and, and it's just old hat for me. I, I don't have to think about it. But you've never done it before. That's why I kind of put everything in there. Anyways, that's, that's kind of why I do these long videos. Is so you'll really won't have to guess at what I did or or why I did something because I tried to explain these the best I can and this is this is all for you guys I know how to do this I don't have to do it um, but I, I put these up here just in case maybe this won't work for you maybe you don't have a four-wheeler but maybe you have a um, a riding lawnmower that you'd like to add this to or maybe you have a side-by-side -side or Shoot, maybe you have an old um, VW Beetle and you want to add a uh, temperature sensor. Yeah, I'm being facetious. The old VWs, they don't have uh, water. They're all air-cooled. But anyways, um, so yeah, that's how you do that. Anyways, I looked all over the place to try and find those private videos and I couldn't find them anywhere or hopefully this will keep you guys from having to look and search and hunt and all that stuff. I hope that helps y'all comment rate and we'll talk to you later. See ya.